Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. Elon Paul here. We're going to be doing the Anomaly Mission. Um, not that too many people may be paying attention to the Anomaly Mission right now, but uh, we're doing the Anomaly Mission in order to uh, make sure we get this taken care of. So I'm going to actually do it with me on the screen. Hello, everybody. So things are a little different. We're doing speed runs like crazy for this last weekend of the expedition, and everybody's going a little nuts with it. Um... Delta still holds the record officially at 49 minutes. I officially have the second place spot at 50. Um, with Jason trying to breathe down our necks right now. But we'll see how that goes. He's actually playing as I'm recording this. So we'll see how it is. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get things started here with the Anomaly mission. And we're going to go ahead and um, see what this mission has to do has in store for us. As you can see, I'm just starting the game. I'm just getting it running. It takes an extra few moments when you first start it up. And I will be doing some training a little bit this afternoon. And you can see me do a speed run on Saturday night. Uh, we're probably going to start a little after 4 p.m. Eastern time. And we're just going to run for a few hours. I don't know how long we're going to do it. So let's see what we got. Got my character here. Let's run over to the Nexus and see what the mission's about this weekend. There we go. All right. Nexus, here we come. Roots of Aggression. Looks like we're eliminating Hazardous Flora again. 1,800 Quicksilver. In my case, I'm going to get 200 tons of frigate fuel along with it. Usually, there's a second one. There it is, 438,567 units. Where it gets that number from, I have no clue. Okay. Starting the mission. So, let's see what planet we end up on this time. Here's our speedrunner, or the starborn runner, I should say. Let's get started. Hope everybody's doing good for this weekend. Like I said, the competition is high right now. Jason, myself, Delta, uh, and Delta, as well as Zane. Zane's been pitching in a little bit as well into the speedrun uh, series. Really looking forward to trying to get this done tomorrow night. Who knows what will happen. That'll be my last attempt. And I am so glad it's over, but at the same time, I've had such a great time. I really have. It's been wonderful. All right, here we are. We're in the Admini system in the Euclid galaxy. Just got to wait for the root thing to pop up. That's a space station. It must be over here. Ah, there we go. All right. Let's scan the planet real quick. I don't think my scanner registered. There we go. Planetary anomaly. Interesting. Ancient bones, emerald. So we're in a green system. Ammonia and magnetized ferrite. Very interesting. Let's see how this goes. All right. Coming in for the landing. These missions only usually last about 10 minutes or so. Maybe 15. Just depends on how things go. All right. So the first thing we need to do is we need to look at our menu up above, our little uh, radar up above. We're looking for a grave marker. Usually close by. It's usually not very far away. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. Let's see it here. Might be up on the plateau up there. That's what I'm thinking. Do another quick circle. Okay. It must be further away than I thought. Let's land up here on the top of the plateau. What do you say? And we'll take a look. So we have to find... Well, hello. <laughs> we can't eliminate the hazardous floor yet. Okay, hold on. Looks like it's right over this way somewhere. All right, let's go take a run. Whoops, sorry. Oh, I think I see it in the distance. You can see it on the ground right over there. All right, looks like we got hazardous plants all around me too, so this ought to be pretty quick. So we have to talk to this first. Snagged around the ankles, piercing thorns, completely unaware. We reduced the numbers, but... Set. The fallen traveler's log seems to mention the floral infestation, but holds no further clues. I will need the scout to, to locate the hazardous flora. 
off we go. Use any tool you want to get them if you like. Um, let's see, this has a runic lens. I got my neutron cannon. I'm going to use the lens to do it this time. There's one right here. So we got our first one. We need 12 all total, it appears. And just look through here. You're going to see little uh, exclamation points everywhere. And you can see this one on the ground right there. Two of them, actually. One, two. Okay, that took care of those two. There's another guy over here. Let's go ahead and take him out. Another one, so that's four. So this planet is, the word is replete. Replete with all kinds of hazardous flora. It doesn't look like the animals are attacking us either, so that's a good thing. So we don't have to worry about them. It doesn't appear to have too many sentinels around here. Don't worry about it telling you it's too weak to find anything. Just go somewhere else and let the landscape reproduce. And... After a couple moments, you'll have some more. There, see? Right there. Right there. Now, normally I'd tell you to head for a cave, but no reason to do so. This particular location is well-suited for it. Let's head over here towards our ship. Go up the little slope here. There we go. And usually within a couple moments, everything pops in. We know there's some by our ship. Let's go ahead and head up there, shall we? All the way up. There we go. And there's one right there. All right. What else we got? It says there's nothing around, but I don't. In it. Go over here to this blank area and wait. Just a moment. For the landscape to populate. Look at that, see? So that's nine. Just got a few more to get. There we go, right there. Ten. Over this way. Oh, it says too weak. That's okay. Let's over this way and get more of the plants to populate in. There's one right in front of us. Eleven. We have one more to get. Looks like we got a whole bunch over here. And there it is. And that should be it. And that's it. That's all there is to it. This seems to be a really quick mission this time, folks. So, back in our ship. And let's take flight. Interesting looking planet. Don't think I'd like to have a house here, though. Pull in our anomaly. In we go. Now, if you land at the space station real quick, you'll have this system in your library, if you will, as you go through teleporters. So you can always find the system again if you ever need to come back to it. You don't have to create a base. I was, that was pointed out to me by somebody who was watching the video. The last video, that is. And, of course, I'm at the furthest parking space. As usual, I do not have the luck of the Jason. So we'll head back to the Nexus, check it out. Pretty sure there's nothing new in the Quicksilver store, but we'll take a look anyway. There we go. Complete the mission. And there we go. Quicksilver gotten. And Quicksilver is mainly used... I don't know why I keep doing that. Ignore that. It's mainly used to purchase things from the store. Decorative materials, things like that. If you like to build things, it's very nice. As you can see, I've already owned everything. So we don't have anything to get this time. So we will see what happens in the next few days because once the expedition's over things are going to change we believe this terminal back here for the expedition is going to go live with expedition um reduxes so you can go in there and choose an expedition to play you may not get the same prizes out of it but you can at least replay the expeditions so i'm going to do a quick thing here i'm going to do this and restore points saved and there we go so, I want to thank you all for watching today. Appreciate it. Uh, please try to watch the stream tomorrow afternoon or wherever, whatever time it is for you, wherever you are at. I do have a couple of announcements. We are going to do, if we can break the record, we're going to do one more playthrough after that to just uh, talk about how a speedrun is done on these things. And we'll discuss why we do speedruns and that kind of thing. And uh, we'll talk about some other things too, but I'll have some important information to, to dispense, if you will. But I want to thank you again, all, all of you, for watching. Appreciate it. Please hit that like button down below. I really would appreciate it. Helps the analytics and helps out my channel. So thank you very much. And again, I hope you have a great weekend. Take care, everybody.